Hi, hello, this is Tiffany um, with Tiff's Creative Tutoring. And today I tutored for out of school for the first time. Yay me! I was nervous, um, although I have done some tutoring online before locally. Um, I hadn't tutored for um, any students that I didn't really know, so that was partly making me nervous. Um, and yeah, just felt a lot of pressure. But anyways, uh, the class that I'm teaching is um, songwriting, fun, lab 101. Um, and um, the way that I figured out what I wanted to teach, at least one class that I wanted to teach is just thinking about something that um, comes naturally to me and something that is fun and I'm passionate about. So maybe that'll help you um, if you are new to teaching online or to out school, think of a class that you want to teach. Um, what else? So I'll just tell you a little bit about um, some things that I took away from my first time teaching on out school. Um, it is important to make sure that you look at um, your out school to see if the students have left a message for you even before your class. Um, because they do leave messages <laughs> uh, and it's important to get familiar with your um, Zoom and how it works with out school. Um, basically you just go on out school, you push live I believe and it goes right to Zoom. And then what I did, and I don't, I'm not sure if I had to, but I just gave the link uh, to the student as far as the comments, sorry, that you can leave for them. Um, I gave the link and the password so that she'd be able to get in. I'm not sure if I was supposed to do that, but I did. Um, yeah, yeah. So my experience was overall good. Um, obviously, when you're nervous, you know, it may not be perfect, but I think it was great. My goal and what always pushes me, even when I feel inadequate, is to remember my why. And my why. Um, most often um, when I take off my professional hat alone is also to make a difference and to uh, leave that person better than I I found them basically I want to encourage them in their purpose and in their gifts and their talents and I just want them to have the confidence to use them and to invest in them um, I felt that I, I think it's really important to leave, give them a tool, to leave them something that they can work with, not just um, show them how to do something, but make it so that it's, it's kind of an experience for them. Don't give them everything, but like paint the, you know, like give them a canvas to work with and, and help them paint it and help them paint it and just leave them to, uh, you know, finish the work. My mantra is engaging, inspiring, and empowering. And for me, it's children and youth. For you, um, it could be you know someone else. But I always think it's important to engage with the student, to inspire them by sharing a part of your story, um, by and empowering them by giving them the tools they need, and then helping them and giving them the space to walk it out. So yeah, so. Um, I just hope this video is encouraging you. To you, I survived the first day um, in teaching of out school. This is the face of a survivor, and this is a, a victor. Um, and it, I believe it's going to be like riding a bike. You, you start riding a little bit, and you ride a little bit more. So if you're nervous, this is a video for you.